All right, Shalom. First, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Kodash, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the elect. Uh, this article came out today, you know, not too long ago. All right, everybody says, uh, U.S. jets strike Syrian town with banned white phosphorus bombs, Russian Defense Ministry. All right, because hey man, things that <laughs> think think that the, the whole the whole uh 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 hot topic has been on on Syria lately. Okay, and things are heating up. It says uh two U.S. jets have bombed a town in the Syrian uh, Deir ez Zor province with white phosphorus munitions, causing massive fires. Russian military has said two F-15 jets on Saturday bombed the town of Hajin with the white pho uh, phosphorus in um incendiary munitions banned under the Geneva Convention, according to the Russian Center for, for Reconciliation in Syria. Following the strikes, large uh, fires were observed in the area. Lieutenant General Vladimir uh, Sav Savchenko, uh, or Savchenko said uh, Sunday, there's still no information on casualties caused by the bombing run, he added. The use of any incendiary, uh, incendiary uh, munitions in populated civilian areas was banned by the 1980 Protocol 3 of the Convention of Certain um, Conventional Weapons. The U.S. signed the protocol back in 2009. So basically, the U.S. just broke that that uh, 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 protocol because uh, by doing what they just did. Fice, uh, 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 white phosphorus, however, is also used for smoke screens and signals which are not banned under the convention. The loophole allows several nations, including the U.S., to keep the white phosphorus-based white phosphorus -based weapons in their arsenal. The chemical burns when it comes into, com in co into contact with oxygen, producing high-temperature heat and white smoke. Exposure to burning phosphorus causes deep burns while are very hard to heal while its fumes are highly toxic. Okay, and here it is. It says what? Um... They bombed a town in Syria. So you know there's going to be casualties. All right, it says Russia's accusations against the U.S. comes as tensions between the two countries soar in the region. The Russian Defense Ministry has repeatedly warned of a false flag chemical attack being prepared by militant uh, groups in, in Idlib, which it says will be used to justify a new U.S. strike against the Syrian government. Moscow has also ha held massive naval drills in the Mediterranean Sea near Syria. The U.S. in its turn has also ramped up its military presence in the area, getting several ships equipped with cruise missiles closer to Syrian shores. President Donald Trump has meanwhile been routinely briefed by the Pentagon on the potential military options the U.S. might take in case of chemical weapons attack. So, <laughs> hey, they're, they're prepared, man. All right, they're prepared, man, and, and something is gonna happen. Okay, things have been pretty quiet lately, but something is gonna happen, man. All right, because what? We're getting closer and closer to the end. All right, and you have a lot of people who are not taking this truth seriously. They're not taking the word of the Most High seriously. So when he does something, that's when they're gonna understand and truly see. Oh shoot, this is not a game anymore. Okay, and best believe once this thing pops off, it's not stopping. All right, it's gonna be nonstop. It's gonna keep on going like it says in Habakkuk. All right, though it tarry, wait for it because it shall come. It, it will surely, it shall come. It, it it will surely come. It will not tarry. Roughly paraphrasing. Okay, so best be prepared for that, man, because there is gonna be a World War Three. All right, in 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 this world, man. All right, there's gonna be a World War Three real soon with nuclear missiles. All right, low will not do a, a a a another video on that. You know, because you had that 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 devil David Ike. He said it in a video like four years ago. All right, which I, I found that this morning, but he said it. All right, and so low well, and you know, I I probably upload that, you know. But hey, man, things are happening. All right, and that's why now is the best time to stay in prophecy, stay occupied in prophecy, and just keep on doing the work. There's gonna come a time where we're not gonna be able to do this the, uh, this work anymore. Okay, and all you're gonna have with you is 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 yeah, what what you did. Okay, the only works that are gonna follow you are the works that you did. All right, not not what another man did. Okay. So, hey, for those of you who are not putting your hands to the plow, those of you who are being lukewarm, the time is going to come. Like the scriptures say, then shall they be known who are my chosen. For those of you who are not doing the work, when that, that time of decision comes during the time of Jacob's trouble, you're going to be left asked out. And then you're going to understand very well that what? The Most High ain't dealing with you. 
because when you had the chance, you did not do the work, man. All right, you were dragging your feet. All right, thinking it was all sweet. Okay, because that's that shows the most high that you don't take it seriously, man. Okay, you have time to do other things, but you can't do the work of the Lord. The most high is going to get you. Okay, this is a serious thing, man. We're talking about life and death. We're talking about life changing experiences that's about to happen upon the earth. All right, that should be that should be something that excites you, but also puts fear in you. All right, what the most high is about to do to this place. Okay, and being that you see it and you know that it's coming, you got to be prepared. And you got to warn the sheep. Okay? So, Lo, willing, this was edifying unto the elect. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rechakodash. Until next time, Shalom.